तो फ्रेंड्स टुडे दिस टॉपिक इज डिटेल लाइन कैंसिल है ओके सो दिस वन ऑफ द इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक वेन आई वी कंसिडर द एम टी आर एंड ओके मोर टारगेट इंडिकेटर है This order is used for the detection of moving target. Okay, so let it be. Uh, after that, we will discuss about the order. Now, the current discussion is on delay line cancel. So this delay line cancel here. It is a filter. It's a filter which is used to eliminate the stationary clutters at zero frequencies. That means it eliminates. Zero frequency clutters. What are clutters? Clutters are the unwanted echoes which we receive whenever we are transmitting a signal through radars. Okay, which might cause the interference of the receiving signal, which is a useful signal. This is an unwanted signal. Both might be interfered, and that result that might be resulting in a different signal, which is not the message signal. It is exactly. This is okay. So these clutters are mostly found at zero frequency. Okay. So this filter is mostly designed in eliminating the zero frequency clutters. Okay. That is why we use this delay line canceller. This is the delay line canceller shown. Okay. We have uh, input coming from the signal process uh, from the radar. Okay. So the transmission part and the receiving part. This is the input. and it is given to the digital a to d converter okay so this is bipolar video signal what we get is the video signal it is converted to digital signal after that whatever delay is there this gives the delay of one by pulse rotation frequency time okay that means let's say uh let V1 be the initial signal, okay? So V1 be the received signal. I'll say two <coughs> pi F T D T P plus five, okay? Or else minus five. You wish. It might be positive phase or negative phase, okay? So two sine pi F T D. Uh, let me let's let us give the it as an amplitude A. Okay? This is the actual signal. Okay, next. V two is the another signal. V two is the another signal. Another means I'm, that means the same signal which is delayed by T P ten minutes. Okay, now if you see here, this is V one. Whatever here we are getting, it is V two. Okay, now that is that will be sine. It is delayed by T P ten minutes. That means the only change we get is two pi F T D T minus T P. Plus five, plus five. Okay. Upon subtracting these two, perform subtraction of these two. That means v one minus v two. Okay. So it is. Let's say this is the capital V is my output, and a sine two pi f t d plus five minus sine two pi f d. T minus T P plus five. So this is the fraction. This sine C minus sine D. After simplification, what you get is A into sine two A into sine two pi F D T. This is the magnitude of the signal. Okay. That that I'll call. See T and T gets cancelled. The only thing remains is Tp that is sine c minus sine d that is two sine cos cos two pi f t d t minus t p t minus t p by two plus or minus five. I'm not getting the details. Is by plus or minus five? The phase is not so important here. Okay, so the the only thing is interesting here is this is a <coughs> This is the given signal. This is the output signal. Whereas this thing is the 
my amplitude of the signal okay i'll call this as the transfer function okay now if you see from the signal processing theory any any output signal will be in the frequency domain multiple of input frequency signal right output signal is transfer function times the input signal so i'll call this as transfer function h of f h of f now this h of f is given by h of f is given by 2a sin 2 pi fd t okay so this is the thing let's take the graph of this how it looks like is okay this is at frequencies fd equal to 1 by tp this is fd equal to 1 by 2 tp as i said 2 fd it is all right 2 fp if we are and is that first expression frequency okay this 2 fp and this is at 3 fp this is at 0 this is mod h of f versus frequency my graph my plot looks like this of the transfer function okay with the amplitude of 2f okay so from this what we infer is that this delay line canceller is for main thing is it is to eliminate the clutters at zero frequencies but what is happening here is okay it is eliminating the clutters at zero doppler frequency okay first thing is it is eliminating clutters at zero doppler frequency that is okay but what it is doing is it is also making the clutter spectrum zero at the frequencies which is not a delta function okay so that means here here it is also making the function the response of the function as zero here okay at what at a integral multiple of the pulse repetition frequency okay what is happening here is whenever the target is moving and if it is if it is having the doppler frequencies then the pulse repetition frequency uh, with the doppler frequency at doppler frequency it is equal to pulse repetition frequency the response of the system is becoming zero whenever the response is zero then the output will also be zero okay so from this a new concept called New concept called blind speeds as a relate. Blind speeds. Okay. This blind speeds, what, what are the blind speeds is that this those are the speeds at which the response of the system is becoming zero. Okay. How to develop this the, the speeds is what we know about Doppler frequency? It is 2 VR by lambda. VR is the radial velocity and lambda is the wavelength okay whenever this doppler frequency is equal to the pulse repetition frequency multiples whenever the doppler frequency is equal to n times that means multiple of pulse repetition frequency how did we get this uh, this is the what is what is this thing this is the frequency response equal to zero then this term should be equal to equal to n pi right now you cancel this fd is equal to n by t p that is n fp whenever this this obeys then the response system is becoming zero okay at that speeds at that frequencies the response is zero using those frequency formula we go with the blind speeds n lambda by 2 fp n lambda by 2 it is time period right okay it is 2 tp it is a Blind speed, nth blind speed we say. It is the nth blind speed. Okay. 
So delay line canceller introduces a concept called blind speeds at which the response of the system is becoming zero. It is eliminating the clutters at zero frequency, but it is not not so effective in deleting eliminating the blind speeds. Okay, blind speeds remain the same whenever delay line canceller is okay. Okay, this delay line canceller is also operated as double delay line canceller. That means there you have two delay line cancellers which are cascaded. Okay, so that's it for the video. If you like it, you share it and also subscribe it for the channel. Thank you.